After a successful 2016 debut, the St. Catharines Art Association is pleased to announce their second Art Lovers Affair. So um, in the evening on the Thursday, we're having an artist reception. Um, we're inviting the media as well as sponsors, etc., to come and get an early preview of what's going to happen at the auction and also the opportunity to speak with the artists because not all the artists are here all the time during the show. So it's a real opportunity for everybody to get together and, and um, enjoy it. Well, I just think it is... Uh off to a wonderful start. We're starting to sell tickets. Um, if you go to our website, St. Catharines Art, then you'll be able to order tickets online. The tickets for the live auction on Saturday, January 11th, uh, sorry, February 11th, are, is $35 a person, and we're going to have a live auction, live entertainment, hot and cold hors d'oeuvres, and complimentary wine. So it'll be an excellent opportunity for people to f purchase fine art at, by emerging and established artists. The chance to make a sale brings an exciting element to the show. This couple came out, up to me and they said, we want to buy that one and it was mine. And so I went and I said to Brenda, who was our president at that time, they want to buy my painting. Brenda turned around and looked at me. She said, they want to buy it? And I said, yeah. I mean, I didn't realize that it wasn't, they didn't come in and just buy it like the supermarket. I mean, there were not many paintings were, you know, got, got sold. And I sold three that time. Photography has been introduced to this year's show. Barry Smith is happy to have his photographs available. It's such a gratifying um, feeling to have people enjoy your work. Um, and the, you know, the sweat that you put into it and, and someone else either sees the same thing that you did or they see something different, but they get, I, I want people to, to feel that emotion or uh, get a, a small story out of what, what I saw. Participants in the Art Affair are members of the Art Association. Each expressed their enjoyment in being a member. The people were so nice. And, and it's been so helpful because you see all different kinds of art and the different things that people do. And it really has been inspiring that we have all tried different things. Oh, it's the best. I've uh, just surrounded by people that have uh, been, been here for years or have only started as well. And it's just been amazing support and, and the friendships that you make. Is the success of year one coupled with the support of Penn Financial and Herdner Estates, creates a promising future for the Art Lovers Affair. I think it's only going to get bigger and better. It's a wonderful way to break up the winter. Um, you know, the, our artists are busy in the spring and summer doing their own shows, and there's always lots going on. But in the winter, there's hardly anything. So it's an opportunity to have a great night out and to, you know, enjoy yourself and, and to dress up a little bit and, and just celebrate art and celebrate our love of art, which is the whole point of this, right? Art Lovers Affair runs for four days from February 9th to February 12th. Be sure to visit Herdner Estates Winery and support this special event by the St. Catharines Art Association. I'm Brenda Schultz, reporting for The Source.